Welcome back. Full and complete shout out to Ryland Gaming on this. I am definitely using a lot of the ideas that his stream came up with. But we're going to add a little bit to it ourselves and make it our own. And then we're going to repurpose it to be the Power Tower version 4. First thing we need, just some simple side walls. And then the second most important object for making beautiful buildings. Turn that one click. I don't think I need all of these, but we're gonna build them. I believe that's the center, so we're gonna turn it the other way. Let's take a step back. Perfect. Now, we're gonna put in the side wall first. It's the most difficult to build, and we need two road barriers. It's the question is always, do you build it on this one, this one, probably not, or this one? We're gonna try this one. Let's try something like that. Then we'll get the small billboard, not the large one. one more partial square. Let's put in one more road barrier like that and see if that will give it to us. Oh, that's too far out. Come on. Perfect. So now this is perfectly in a line with this. So we're on one foundation worth. Love it, love it, love it, love it. All right. Do the same thing on this side. We'll check it to make sure. that we're on on grid beautiful okay now we just need some walls done. Let's get in here and delete some of these road barriers. And by some, I of course mean all. Already starting to get a little bit of the effect, but we're not there yet. Then we're gonna take these and we're just gonna smash them right in. Let's see if we can get the first one in. It's tough because the uh, the wall placement, but we got it All right there. I think. And I can 
snap that one to the previous one. Then I can snap that one to the previous one. Then I can snap that one to the previous one. Just like that. It's a lot of shenanigans. Give ourselves a little room to run and jump. Oh, we jumped too far. Well, let's see if we can get there. All right, so we want to set the background to everybody's high-tech grid. And then we'll pick... I'm going to go with the default satisfactory orange to start. Then we're going to turn this all the way off. And we obviously don't want words what we do want is super bright and super glossy we're going to copy that paste 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 i think i might have missed one of these paste actions but we'll see when we test it here in a second And paste. Well, yeah, we missed this one. There you go. It's starting to happen. And then, as per our usual, we're going to put in a organization. Give us the biggest one you've got. Oh, we don't have the reinforced plate. Okay, now we do. Oh, you know what? It's not gonna let us put this in this place because we're gonna have to do some shenanigans to make that happen. Let's take these out. Then we'll get the MVP of making beautiful buildings. And we'll click on you and take you up a little bit like that. Then we'll put this onto here, but is that where I want it to be? I, I kind of want it back one. Is it possible to get it off grid a little bit? That's probably too far back though, right? Let's see, how do I do this? Actually, I think that this will do it for us. Let's get this going all the way up, though. And slip around here if we can. Rebuild these. Just to make sure. Come on. And then we'll get our labels in place. I might need to duplicate this before we put this in. Oh no, no, this is perfect. This is perfect. When we go to build it, it's gonna be a little different, but this is perfect to get us going. So what we need this to be is, oh, probably not super bright, but bright. And then we want a layout of just one big letter.
All right, and then you can already see the effect. It's looking so good. We're gonna call this the um, power, power, my term, V4. Uh, mirror? I did all that and then it didn't save it. Power tower v4 mirror. Save. Then Let's see if it's even possible to snap this. You know what? It's so easy to build these parts. We should just build them. I don't know what I was thinking. Really, I need two of these to have a, a good sense of where everything needs to be. The hardest part is going to be to get this blue, this billboard in. All right. Here's how we'll do this. We'll just delete you and delete you for a moment and copy you directly on top of you. Then put you back in place. Let's put all the screens in first. off. Try building that again. Nice. Then we'll just build another. Oh, wait. Yeah, we got to put this guy in over here. One more, come on. When you go to do this, you'll have the advantage of knowing that you need two of these so you can zoop it up. My intention is to have a fully stackable version of this that we can build as the basis of our power tower. I'm just having a little trouble pulling angle. There we go. Whoop. I don't know what that was.
All right, and then for each one of these, it'll be power tower V4, right? So we need to drop something like that. And now I th think we can drop the supporting pillar. And this will say, for instance, let's turn this brightness up. And then I think I wanna change the color to just a stark white. but we want to keep the black background. Something like that. I'm not sure if that's perfect, but that's that's where we're headed. Let's get this layout. Yes, exactly. And then this will be a four. A four. And then this one will be likely a lowercase v but let's copy this jump paste jump again edit and change this to v copy jump paste jump paste You know what? I don't want that. Oh boy. I want this in the middle of this. Vertically in the middle. I mean, this is good. I'm happy. But I'm not satisfied. That's a two meter. This one meter should give us half. Then I can delete that one. I should be able to delete this and then put this. Oh, but now it's not centered on that side. Oh wait, that was it. I had it. Somewhere in there, there we go. Oh, that's sadness. Okay, it's gonna make us redo this. Let me think for a minute. Perfectionist is kicking in all of a sudden. I've got to do this. I've got to do this right. So let's put this in here. And now the question is... Can I have best of both worlds? Yes, exactly there. Then we'll have Let's just go above and beyond here for a minute. Then we'll go there. Click there and there. One more time, let's build the back and then I think we're done.
that should have brought it just off of it and it did we'll copy you paste and paste paste and paste and then we'll make you layout I like the white ones because that mean, makes it pop in the glass that much more. And a lowercase v. Is it a lowercase v with a period? I don't think so. And it makes it off-center if you do it that way. I think we just go with the V. Then if we take a step back and look at that, there you go. Okay, so the only thing is wrong now is that we've got this little gap right here. And I think we'll use this guy one more time. Oh man, it's coming way out of the grid. Mm, but it might be okay in the front. As long as it remains stackable in the back, I think we're okay. That feels like it's a little protruding. But I think that is the right place. The white might be the way to go. All right, let's save that again. So nice. And then as an experiment, let's see if it'll allow us to duplicate it. We might have to do it manually. It's such a weird, weird shaped blueprint. It's probably not gonna like it. Let's try higher ground. Yeah, it's gonna be interesting actually building this. We're probably going to have to go to... Oof. Even with default mode turned on, it's still trying desperately to link up to weird places. Well, that might be something we're going to have to figure out Wait a minute, I'm also short on beams. Yeah, I think we're gonna have to, I mean, we've gotta believe that it's gonna work. It's a blueprint, it's good to go. It's all the same height. It's perfectly stackable, everything's aligned. It's working. It'll just have to have a little drama associated with it when we try to go and build it. So I can even see the, the Z fighting is telling me that it's working. All right, and then I think, I think we should 
darken these. It's very stark, that white. Maybe gray these out. Or go for the orange. A lot of these options are working, but we're definitely into like customization on top of customization. You can choose whatever color foundations you want. You can choose whatever pipes you want. Um, but the basic concept of having the power tower, and this of course is gonna get, you know, we're gonna spell power tower V4, but now it's nice and centered, right? So that way when we get to the bottom, it won't be on the, the very ground. And when we get to the top, it won't be on the very top. The hardest part of this whole thing is gonna be figuring out how to get it built with the blueprint. Or we just don't have enough encased beams. Let me, I, I can't help it. I gotta try. We need 36 encased beams. I'll be right back. I'll grab those and then we'll see if we can build this thing as far as a uh, extending it. Cause we're planning to build eight of these. Power tower is V4 is 16 letters with spaces. Each section of this has two letters. If we put two of these on top of each other, that's four. So 16 divided by four is four. If we could get this duplicated one time, that would be the ideal. Let me go grab some uh, encased beams. I'll be right back and then we'll finish this thing up. Hey, we're on our way back. Figured we try to take a aerial view. All right. Let's see if we can get this second one built. Oh man. I somehow also don't have reinforced plate. Let's see what else I don't have before I try this again. Six reinforced plate. All right. There we go. And this is with the fault. Oh boy, this is gonna be, this is gonna be tough to build. So I don't want to put foundations on it. So I want it to be a contiguous piece. If it makes more sense, I guess I could go ahead and just build it all the way out, but I gotta think there's a way. Yeah, if I try to pull it over that way, it then says, oh, you want to link to these uh, angled mirror thingies, right? So let's let's make that our center of gravity, but no. Oh man, nudge would make this incredibly easy. The only other way that I could think to do this, hmm, well, I think that's going to be part of our build video. 
I have a couple ideas. We can get this done. But right now, the blueprint is done. If you just wanted this as part of like a small, like a corner of a building or an art installation in your hub area, then this is done. And you have two easy ways that you could put some letters in. This could be like the entry or the side piece to your um, your iron factory or something like that, or your silica factory, obviously. Silica and quartz crystal factory. This would be a great decoration piece for that. Lots of options. I'm going to figure out how to stack this thing because I am dead set on making this the power tower version four. And, but that's something for me to deal with and for you to experience the benefits of. Oh, I didn't mean to get aggressive there. In the next video. Thanks for hanging out. I'm thinking that, that seems screenshot worthy right there, doesn't it? And we'll see you next time.